Okay. Now, firstly, what you want to do is just go to emulator, emulator, sorry, zone dot com. And just click on Sony PlayStation. And just sorry, just waiting for mine to load. Hmm. Okay. Go to EPSXE. As they say, the best free emulator. Just download the first link, EPSXE 1.6.0. And just save that, you know, to where wherever you want. Now you just want to open that. And you'll see all your files. That's that's everything. You know, just you want to go to Google and type in SCHP101 download. Oh, 1001. Oh, sorry, SCPH1001. And just go to the first link. It should be called Dragon Ball Arena. Just go down, and you'll see one called BIOS PSX. SCPH1001. You want to download that one. Not anything else. Just do the same with that. Save it to wherever you want. Just open that. And what you want to do is you want to copy that. Oh. I just click and drag and put that into BIOS. Huh. Didn't work. So let me try again. Huh. Oh, right. Sorry, it's still in a zip. I'll just have, yeah, I'll just have to extract it. So, just wait till that extracts. Open the folder. Yeah, no mistake. Anyway, you just want to go to BIOS and copy that bin file or drag and put it in to the bin BIOS folder in all your files. Now you want to go to uh, I believe it's that's oh, right. You want PayOps. Video plugin. Okay, so just search that in Google. And the first link, VT Emulation Network. That's the one you want. And you just want to get. You just want to get that one right there. Yep, PEOPS Soft GPU. Let's click on the V1.16. Save it to the disk. Yeah. Now you just want to minimize all those. All the f things you have open, you can close that. Now open this. Now go out of BIOS, and where you want to go is plugins. Now in plugins, just copy all the files in that PUP zip, put them into plugins. Now it's all them, which is good. Now, once you've done that, you're pretty much done. All you need to do is click on video, make sure it's PEOPS Soft Driver 1.16. Go to your BIOS, just find that. Make sure it's that one, the right one. Okay, just use that one. And then, just want to go to the wizard guide to configure it. So you just click config. Now that should be there. I've had a few people with problems.
I had it. I had it a few times myself, but I fixed it anyway. Yep, and you just wanna just click, keep on clicking next to all that rubbish. And then if you already have an ISO, you just wanna open it. And my screen's going all weird. Odd. Okay. Oh, there we go. Anyway, you just want to play that. And then it's all good. Show you that again. So, just want to run ISO. FF90 or whatever you have. Watch my screen go demented and all fucked up like. Anyway, yeah.